certificate of the very first round. You ready? You ready? All right, so here we go with round one for this man. It has been a career defined by longevity. He has been a fan favorite, and part of that is because he's been... Whoa! here, but unable to find the target there. Just over three minutes to go round one. How about the volume of kicks out of this fighter tonight? And it really speaks to just how much a fighter can develop in three to five months away from the other. Yeah, he's doing a Oh! He's out! Wow! What a performance! Pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent solely saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. All right, let's re-rack the highlight now, DC. And he's certainly going to enjoy watching this one back. The head kick was there early, it was there often, and ultimately ended the night for his opponent. He found a weakness in his opponent's game. The left kick, over and over, he was able to land it. And he was landing the strikes, too, with his hands. But ultimately, it was the kick that was hidden behind the punch that finished the fight for him. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliotta calls a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 14 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the Union UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, Kelly. Well, he came in as the undisputed UFC light heavyweight champion, and after that result, he goes out the way he came in, and still, ladies and gentlemen, and nice to see this moment now as he celebrates with his corner. That was as dominating a title defense as we've seen thus far this year as he knocks out the number one contender, and really in so doing, sends a message to the other contender types at 205 pounds that it's gonna take your best night and best performance, and even then, I'm still probably...